how to use CC and BCC in Gmail app. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from App Guide. In today's guide video, I'll show you the way on how you can actually use CC, also known as carbon copy, and BCC, also known as blank carbon copy. But before we get started with the video, if you are new to our channel, make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button. And without any further ado or delay, let's get started with today's video. Well, in order to use CC and BCC, it's very simple. I'll also show you what those functions mean. So first of all, open up the Gmail application and just tap on the compose button now let's say you have a particular email let's say any random email you want to send this to the main primary recipient so just go ahead and then paste the email of the recipient or enter the email of the recipient now this person will be able to reply back to your email and they'll be able to see who sent them as well but on another occasion let's say you only want to send the email but you don't want to let them know and you don't want a response from them so in that case you can add them to your cc which is the carbon copy so just tap on the three dots over here and select the option called cc and over here you can simply go ahead and then enter the email address to whom you want to send the email but you don't want to receive from and the bcc means that let's say you enter their email over here now this person will also not be able to reply back to your email but what this does is that it will also not let this person know to whom the other emails were sent for example you send the email to cc but the bcc will not be able to know to who the cc was or who the primary email was sent to so it will only receive the bcc email and it will not be able to reply back as well so just keep that in mind after that you can go ahead and then enter your subject and then enter your email address and just tap on the send button which is on the top right corner of the screen once you've tapped on the send button basically you can just go ahead and then enter your email and they'll basically get notified so keep in mind that the primary email will be able to respond to it the secondary email will not be able to do and the third email will also not be able to respond but at the same time they will not be able to know to whom other recipients the email was sent to so once you've just done all of that just tap on the send button over here and then tap on the save or send button whatever you want to do to this and this is basically how you could go ahead and then use the cc and bcc in gmail app we hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you've got any more questions queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down below thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video